these pictures tell the story. Dozens of Shih Tzus suffering, treated so poorly, their fur is matted, their skin covered in sores. Now they're being cared for by the APL. And we're wondering how this happened. John Kosick, you saw these animals up close. They're suffering quite apparent. It was gut-wrenching, Lee, and that's not a term that I just throw out there very loosely. The pictures you're about to see range from absolutely adorable to downright deplorable. One by one, the 33 Shih Tzus are brought into the Cleveland APL after being rescued from a home in Parma Heights. The puppies, nine in all, were in the best shape. They were the money makers, say investigators, in what they called a hoarding breeding situation. The adults no. were the breeders. Some so severely matted in cases it was tough to make them out through the clumps of hair. Where's your ear? The weight that they're carrying around in these mats is, is just unbelievable. And this is a clear case of, of neglect and, and really pretty significant suffering. Investigators learned of the situation through an anonymous call they believe came from someone who went to purchase a puppy from the home, but they weren't allowed in. The puppy was brought out and brushed off when shown. They became concerned about it, gave us a call. What was found shocked even investigators. Just when I think I've seen it all, I see something like this, and um, it's, it's terrible. The owner has not yet been charged. All 33 dogs are being evaluated, treated, and groomed before being put up for adoption. We're hoping to have at least some of them available for adoption soon, so people should watch our website. Now, the owner's name has not been released. It will be released once he is charged, but animal abuse in Ohio is only a misdemeanor crime. Reporting live in Cleveland, John Kosick, News Channel 5.